crossing Marikina River may soon be faster and easier for Marikenos and to anyone visiting the Shu capital of the Philippines. Since the Department of Public Works and Highways, along with the Asian Development Bank, signed a Memorandum of Understanding for a loan application for three bridge projects. The proposed three bridges are the J.P. Rizal Lopez Haina Bridge, J.P. Rizal St. Mary Bridge, and the Marikina Vista Real Bridge. These projects aim to provide motorists with more ways of getting from one side to another. In the signed MOU, the scheduled timeline for engineering works, loan processing and procurement, as well as the ADB financing program for the three bridges are listed. Also included are the review and approval of the projects by National Economic and Development Authority's Investment Coordination Committee. PWH is already making preparations and is also working on the engineering design of the infrastructure projects. In addition, the DPWH is coordinating with the local government units of Marikina and Quezon City in order to confirm the alignment of the three bridge projects. The conduct of DED also under the ADB's Infrastructure Preparation and Innovation Facility since July 2020 is critical to the successful and timely execution of the procurement of civil works, as well as other due diligence including social safeguards, economics and financial management which are required for the processing of the loan. With additional river crossing structures, the bridge projects are fully supported by LGUs of Marikina City and Quezon City, as per letter received by DPWH last December 2020. The proposed JP Rizal Lopez Haina Bridge will be a steel Nielsen Arc Bridge with a length of 687 meters with a main bridge of 460 meters. Budget allocation of the bridge is 1.61 billion pesos. The J.P. Rizal St. Mary Bridge, meanwhile, will be the longest among the three bridges, with a length of 1,444 meters, including a main bridge of 330 meters, connecting J.P. Rizal Street and A. Bonifacio Avenue. It will be a pre-stressed concrete extra dose bridge with a construction budget of 5.74 billion pesos. Lastly, the Marikina Vista Real Bridge will be a 940 meters pre-stressed concrete extra dose bridge including main bridge of 485 meters in length that will cost around 1.81 billion pesos. While all three bridges are in the process of detailed engineering design preparation, the Marikina Vista Real Bridge, also known as the Kabayani Katipunan Avenue Extension Bridge, has been approved to start construction this year or early next year. For more construction updates and news on Philippine economy, Please like, subscribe, and ring the bell of Booming Philippines. Have a great day, everyone. What you giving, that's how we live it. Don't be mad at the system, it's simply how we've existed. I hear a lot of people talking like they politicians and choose to be an accountant because it's safe in the business. Not because they want to do it, just because they heard it pays and who the fuck wants to be...